What is going on everybody? It is Ahmed and I am back today with yet another video for you all. And today guys, we're going to be talking about Terra Luna Classic and UST or the depegged stablecoin that was part of the Terra Luna ecosystem. As always, I like to preface by saying that I'm not a financial advisor, but rather I always try to put you guys on the plays that I'm in. And what in the world is happening right now? Terra Classic or LUNC is up 66% on the day. We thought it was just a short rally, but it continues on even 24 hours later. Trade volumes over a billion dollars, up 219% on the day. UST is up 83%. The lost hope, the lost cause, as people said. You guys know for me, I bought into UST at about 68 cents per token. And it went down way below where it is today, under even 0.01 cents. So it's up almost 10x in the last seven days. So the question is, what in the world is going on? Why is this happening? So we're going to go ahead and dive in. But before I do so and talk about the article that I read, we're going to go ahead and talk about the link in the description below for Moomoo. Moo. Make sure you get your five free stocks. Excuse me, not five, 10 free stocks when you deposit money into your Moomoo Moo trading account. If you deposit $100, you get an extra share of Lucid Motors, which is, again, a luxury EV stock. But otherwise, again, take advantage of free money when it presents itself, especially if we're going to be going into a recession. You don't want to lose advantage. You don't want to not take advantage of free stocks and free shares. You can liquidate them, take the cash, and do whatever you want with it. So this article, I think, sums up kind of what is going on right now. Playing with the ashes. Terra Ecosystems diehard fans refuse to give up as Luna Classics LUNT burn picks up. Terra has become synonymous with the word misery in the cryptosphere, leaving behind countless tales of shattered dreams when the erstwhile high-flying stablecoin UST or skip UST or Terra USD and its sister coin Luna experienced a death spiral a few weeks back. But that is not preventing a new breed of risk takers from betting on the burnt embers of the Terra ecosystem 1.0. What we are seeing here, folks, to my understanding and my vision, what I have personally been seeing, and I think the article wraps it up really well, is kind of people treating this like a degenerate meme coin almost where a lot of people are aping in a lot of people are coming together as a community coming together and this is why i always say never underestimate the power of community never underestimate the power of social media but that's what's happening right now people are binding together to try to bring this back up imagine if we see usd go back to a dollar that's not a 10x from here we're talking nearly a 35x from current value to see go back to all-time high and luna or l-u-n-c all people want to see for this is a dollar, a cent, a tenth of a cent. People are just excited to see what could happen. So if it burns off one zero, it's going to actually be going to a tenth of a cent. And if it happens again, we're going to see this go to a penny. Now, again, if we look at the seven day chart here, we saw this thing go to 0 0.123405. Right now it's sitting at three zeros one. So it has not only two X, but almost even three X from its all time low just about seven days ago. So time will tell. If you look at the overall global cryptocurrency market, today's been a bear day, right? Very bearish. The bears are taking over the market. We're seeing Bitcoin trying to drop below. There it goes, 19,965, Ethereum at 1,100. Things aren't looking too hot for crypto as we're anticipating the GDP reports that are gonna be coming out next month in July. If GDP is negative, two negatives in a row equals a recession. If that happens, of course, consumer spending, investor spending, goes significantly down and if it goes down that means the market's bear the bear market will continue trucking forward potentially to the end of the year if that doesn't happen and gdp is positive consumer sending might go back up the interest rates might not go they might not increase interest rates as aggressively and then we'll see what actually is going to happen so again i'm excited to see what happens only time will tell so i sorry i almost felt like i needed to sneeze but it didn't come out but again, appreciate your guys' support as always. Smash the like button. If you're a part of this LUNC or lunatic community and looking to see if UST goes back to a dollar and LUNC goes to a penny. Only time will tell. Appreciate your support. And until next time, everybody, as always, keep investing. Peace.